Hi there everybody, I'm Andy and welcome back to another episode, sorry, gotta keep my eye on this game, <laughs> of Dungeon Nightmares 2. Now in the last episode, Josh was with me uh, and he insisted, I tried to remind you, don't you remember this is going to be like the first Dungeon Nightmares, how scary it was, and it was scary for him and everything and you know even though he came back to do a few more with me you know he was like no that, that's it and for some reason Josh decided he had to sit in yesterday I don't know why you know I guess he's just morbid curiosity or whatever well I asked him I told him I was gonna go ahead and do another episode because I wanted to see if I couldn't at least get to the exit so we can see what happens next and I, I asked I said did you want to sit in with me and he was like no <laughs> so <clears throat> I think part of it, it's not so much the graphics on the on the game, it's loud. So, uh, you know, it's not because we got the volume turned up all the way. It's just, you know, normally to play horror games, you're supposed to set the atmosphere not only on the computer, but, you know, with yourself. And uh, one of the things, of course, he that play at night with the lights off and stuff. I can't do that since I'm recording. But the main thing is earphones. So I use earphones because I don't want my external speakers doing a, a feedback loop onto the, the video recording me. However, play horror games properly, especially horror survival games like this, you should wear earphones. Uh, try wearing the earphones while watching my videos and then you'll pretty much be hearing what I'm hearing, so okay? So anyway, it's there's a lot of the jump scares and stuff. It's the startling loud sound and it kind of hurts his ears and I don't blame him. So I'm an old guy who's half deaf and I'm stalling. I know I'm stalling. Anyway, instead of, you know, going through the whole wake up routine and all that or any stuff, because <clears throat> so far in the second one, it's just like the first one. Is that a fly flying around? Um, you can't really save that I know of. And I don't know. I bet you that if you die here, you start all over at the beginning too. So this dude look like flies. But so anyway, remember, there's nothing really a whole lot going on on up here in this apartment complex it's just really creepy looking with the shadowy looking bugs um so i just came straight to the elevator okay so we're gonna go in here um some of the jump scares probably if it's the same ones probably won't nail me quite as bad as they did yesterday but that's okay because remember we weren't down here for that long so there's going to probably be all new jump scares for me so let's go in here and continue with the self-abuse. <laughs> you know, I noticed when I do a lot of my recordings, I'll start to tell you guys something and then I'll either get interrupted or I'll interrupt myself and not finish it. I really apologize for that. You know, I kept trying to tell you guys about uh, the flash for lighting your candle in the second one. In the first one, when you said light a candle, it was like you struck a match or something like that, you know? But in this one, you've got a lighter or something, and so you're able to make a bright flash. It's a noisy elevator, right? There's, and I kept saying, well, there's a problem with that, and I don't think I ever finished saying what it is. And I'm gonna show you guys and say it, okay? I hit the C key to make the flash. Now, as you saw, it lit up this room, but then the screen immediately went dark. That's what happens in real life, um, in case you've never noticed it. Go into, you know, a dark room and do that real quick and it'll flash light up but what it does is it causes your pupils to dilate and then everything looks dark again all right Ooh. so that's what I kept trying to say okay yesterday I kept thinking those white things were hello <laughs> scrolled up papers or candles and I don't know what's up with the bloody cups either and there was a picture with a red eyeball it really freaked me out and there's another picture it doesn't look like an eyeball though all right okay who's who's a moving around who's a moving around with the chain man what you think you try to scare me you ain't gonna scare me is I should not touch it. Why? There's nothing in there I want. Okay. I don't know what the bags are. Oh, well, the horrible sounding doors, man. I 
Halo. Oke. Okay. <laughs> What? <laughs> What? Quit being so dramatic. Useless items in here. Okay. Why don't you let me be the judge of what's useless or not? <laughs> God! <laughs> Now, does that red stuff mean that I've been hurt? He awakes. <laughs> There's nothing inside I want. Okay, in the first one, it was a he. Well, they kept saying he, didn't it? Was he? No, she. Yeah, the first, the, the protagonist, or not protagonist, but the monster was this girl who was in bloody bandages and stuff like that. So, so scared, so scared, so scared, so scared. I imagine so, man. Okay. It's like a giant's coming. What? 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 But I run out of candles. I might need to lighten this up so y'all can see better. Because I noticed the video comes out kind of dark. I don't want to stand in that thing, man. There's another weird looking... What is that picture? I don't know what that picture is. Okay, time to look at the map. Which is too low. I think. Okay, we're about... I'm going to go through this little corridor here. Him again. I'm gonna go to this little quarter over here. Did I get another map? Ah, another candle. Yeah. I I don't trust you guys. I know what you were doing in the first game, and it sucked. Stalking us. Hey, <laughs> nothing there. Ooh, okay. We found the key right away. Now I'm supposed to find the exit, and we found out yesterday that the elevator is not the exit, so... Alright. Uh, I'm hearing that noise again. It sounds like something's coming out here. Screw you! in here I can't see anything ahead and and I don't know where I'm going and I feel like I'm going in circles now oh. Seriously, you need to move the map up some it's it's hard. I don't like it being so far down. You can't see the whole map. I need to see the whole map to see where I'm going. Right. Yeah, I know I found the artifact, but what I'm looking for is candles. <laughs> Plus, I don't know what else is in here. <laughs> don't think it's a dead end room. Okay, so I'm in the dead end room. Let's go out and to the left. Okay, okay, we're gonna go out and to the left. Whoa, whoa, no, that's not the video messing up. I'm hearing that sound too, that huh. It's that little girl, oh God. Stop it, stop being so scary. And yet, strangely addicting. Okay. Uh, oh. oh, Josh! Oh, Josh wasn't kidding! Josh was right! Those are choppy choppies! Oh my god, that thing almost chopped us in half! <laughs> oh, oh. Josh yesterday goes, I thought it was just. 
a broken part of door frame or something. Josh said that, you know, don't go to the choppy choppy room. I know what he was talking about. But that thing does do choppy choppy. Oh. Oh. Man. Uh, I had someone on ATS ask me, because I post my videos over there. How can you play these scary games, man? They were talking about how they would have to, uh, 27 January 1978, I am lost and cannot get out, John. Sucks to be you, John. Anyway, um, you know, talking about, you know, doesn't it give you a heart attack and stuff like that. <laughs> Fudge. <laughs> they had that in the first game. <laughs> nice to see it's in the second one, too. Ooh, ooh, my video is doing its thing again. <gasps> Oh, no, 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 that makes it even creepier. Oh, my God. <laughs> you couldn't do that in the first one. Oh, man, we're seeing them move around. Oh, that is, ooh, that is, oh, that's enough of that. All right, Bob. Mmm. Oh, anyway, I don't normally play horror games all the time, okay? I really, I don't, I don't. I put out a lot of videos, but that doesn't mean that's what I'm sitting at home for entertainment and everything. The only reason that I've been doing some of these videos is because people like to see me do them. I guess, you know, it, it's 13 September 1983, I'm so hungry, someone help me, Alice. Oh, um, where am I? I am there. I'm trying to find the exit, guys. And, and so far, things have not been going my way. I mean, at least I found the artifact right away. Ugh. Where am I? Oh, my candle just went out. Okay, we need to go straight left. Okay, go through here. Oh, we're in the elevator room. Oh, ho, 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 ho. screw you. <laughs> okay, all right, that's the elevator room. I'm gonna go straight and bear over to the left. I'm gonna bear to the left. Because I can't bear what I'm doing now. Ugh. Ugh. Right, this is the way I wanna go? I hate looking down for the M key. Cause you know, I gotta feel like something's going to happen. And in one of my, the first Dungeon Nightmare video, something did. video where is is right when I looked was looking at the map the screaming bandage girl came out right when I started to look at the map was when the screaming happened die no thank you <laughs> how rude <laughs> okay um, let's go straight up uh, no straight up you did put an K monkey. You did put an exit in, right? I mean, I know this is an alpha, and it's pretty much a demo. You you did make a way to where we can at least get the first part done. Yes, maybe. How long have I been playing? Fourteen minutes. <laughs> Feels like an hour. Okay. Um. All right. Let's go in here. Hello. <laughs> Some more candles would help. No, more bloody glasses. Oh, good, a candle. Man, that was freaky with the the skeleton and the. I don't want anyone to know I'm here. Quit doing that. Where am I? 
keep getting up. Straight. We are going straight. I am going straight. Nothing's gonna happen. Don't chop me. It's new creepy sounds. It's sounds that, that are, are new and creepy. Where is the exit? Please let me get to the, oh, ooh, is it? Maybe? Oh, 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 oh. Turn, turn. Ooh, it's not automatic. You gotta have time. Wait, where am I going? No, up. No, we went up, not down. <laughs> no. You know, I can make this creep here. Darken out the the light, you know, room even more and use a black light, you know, my black light. <laughs> November 26, 12, 30 p.m. The funny thing is, is when I started, it said November 26, 12, 12. Okay, all right, now, since y'all are with, let's turn on the light real quick. Since y'all are with me, Now we can go out here and check out room 313. Has anything changed? There's a rocking chair with the table. Oh, and Alice, I didn't explain the plain painting. For any of you that never watched the, the my first videos with the first game, Dungeon Nightmares, this painting um, is in the first game, and it's this girl with really long neck. And as you can see, her eyes are slightly closed here. And in the first Dungeon Nightmares, you find this painting down in a dungeon, and you'll hear crying from it. This little girl crying. You don't walk up to it. Because if you do, after a while, well, if you stare at it long enough, its eyes jerk open and you die. <laughs> but <clears throat> the reason I did the turnaround is there's another painting where her eyes are already open. And the first time me and Josh were looking at it closely, when I, I, I was like, okay, let's go. When I turned around like that, jump scare. Something jumped at us, though. So. Okay, that's 308. 306. 305. 304. 303. Is it one of these down here? Oh. That's okay, so this is the beginning. So you either gotta go left or right. Man, I still can't get over that skeleton. I mean, it was scary enough in the first game, but seeing it move around while I was flashing my lighter, that was like, oh my god. That's not a good thing. 311, 312. So I gotta go all the way down here from 313? Here, I was trying to make it quick for y'all. And I apologize for Josh's camera battery running out. I also, it only wants to do 15 minute intervals on that camera, that DSL. Here it is. Here we go. Ooh. <laughs> Here we go. Hello? You want to play ball? I'll play ball. I'll play. I can't go in. Oh. C key doesn't do anything. Do I stand and wait for the little the the woman to stop uh, singing? Hello? Can I? I can't click on it or anything. Okay. Well, I'm not sure what that means. But again, K Monkey's not done with this. Is an alpha, and she said there'd be changes and stuff like that. It's creepy. I forgot. What's further down this hall? More darkness. I forgot about the doors being loud and stuff. Okay, so I assume that I'm supposed to go back down the elevator. 
for more self abuse. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I need my perilous sunglasses, you know, the ones that block out everything so I can't see. Um. Alright, I'm gonna get on it and see where it goes and then I gotta stop the video because it will have been 20 minutes. The little kid got me good. And that's because, well, there didn't seem to be anything up in these apartment hallways. So. <laughs> and I, need, I still need to finish Outlast, man. I'm a, oh. Problem is, is having time. There's been a lot going on with scouting and stuff like that. My real life schedule. Um, stuff that I have to do on ATS takes up some time. Yeah, so. Okay, guys. Oh, no candles. But heads. Alright, I'm going to end this here. And then he started me out with no candles. But heads! <laughs> Alright, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you're having a great day and or night out there wherever you are. Uh, please take care of yourself and stay safe. Tomorrow's Thanksgiving for us here in the United States of America, which normally involves imbibing lots of food and stuff, but just don't forget what the holiday is, you know, it's to be thankful for things and everything, and I'm very thankful for my life and, and my family and my children, my grandchildren, I don't unfortunately get to see too much and stuff like that. I'm also grateful for all of you guys out there that watch my videos, and if you find them, give you at least a smile or a chuckle, so I appreciate it. So take care of yourself out there. Stay safe. Have a good holiday tomorrow if you're celebrating it. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.